Blackfish, Big Nuts Required, Jersey. Here we go. Does this psychopath realize that only 4% of his audience is female? So you're telling me there's a chance? No. What? You are a Uh-oh. Somebody better get that net. Oh, boy. This is where I went. Live action coming in front of you right now. Ladies and gentlemen, those gentlemen right there, that is Captain Jeff Curley right there, with a bear on the rod right there. And standing behind him is his broski Matoski Scooter, a.k.a. Scott. All right? I'm jacked up right now for this episode because I've been trying to get this episode with these cats down in Jersey for two years now. It's the second year. Uh, a couple of con men reached out. Then we start talking, we said we gotta get an episode together, and what we do, we put an episode together, a Blackfish episode. Did I think it was gonna come out this well? Yeah, as a matter of fact, I did. All right? I had complete confidence in these guys. Been following them on social media, that's them right here. Follow those cats right there. Oh my gosh, that's them right there in the uh, picture too. Hello, governor! All right, but what we do, we go out there, we are fishing in the Captain Bill's Landing, which I thought was a restaurant, apparently not, it's a tackle shop down in Jay-Z. And uh, we are fishing a tail tog blackfish tournament there, all right? We are totally loaded up with all our gear, white crabs, green crabs. maja has got 80, probably 80,000 sandwiches, Italian sandwiches. And uh, what else do we have? I bought some Fruit Loop beer. I got it over at uh, a place up in St. James here. $54 a case. The kid gets a fair. $15.99, all right? Because I'm frugal, all right? And uh, we go out there and we start staying a little bit of some fish. I'm going to full disclosure right now. Captain Jeff drops out the first piece. He is kicking like a ninja. He's whacking fish like crazy. What do I have? Nothing. I'm completely atrocious, doing zero for the team to put fish on the boat right now. I mean, it felt like it was my first time ever black fishing. All right, but we'll get to that. Because at the end, the kick comes through. All right, but that's not important right now. Just the more, more important part of this is that I am human, all right? Yeah, I was atrocious on the first drop. Me and Maja, we couldn't make anything. We just couldn't make it happen, all right? But thank God the Curly Boys. And we had Steve and Sean on the boat helping out here for this tournament, all right? So let's start off with a monster. Captain Jeff is on a very light tackle rod he built himself. The guy's got skills, man. I'll tell you, we're going to get into his skills as this video progresses. But he's got skills. He's on to a beast right now. Light tackle on a jig. Let's look at it. Uh-oh. Somebody better get that net. Oh, boy. This is where I'm going to for. Live action coming in front of you right now. I'd love to say that's the first one. Cat is on a fish here. A legit fish right now. Just so happens the kid gets the right camera ready at the right time. <laughs> we got Scott on the net. Oh, oh boy. That's not good. That's great. You kidding me? Fine with this, Tony. What's great about that is I have a camera in my hand. This is a, this is a double digger right here. Keep going. Oh! Oh, fuck! Yeah! Oh, yeah! yeah. 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 I need five more of those, baby. Bro, that's a, that's that's a ridiculous a fish. Ah. That is oh, a ridiculous yeah. fish, bro. Wow. wow! Holy crap! Big nuts for the boy. Pick that bad boy up. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Look at the size of him. I was about to say, he, wow. yeah, he doesn't catch any fish. Yeah, He's put on a clinic right now. Look at the size nice of that one. fish. Four, it's probably around 12. Yeah, and a half. 12. It's 12 last, 24, right? 16 at 27. The week, the week. Uh, Jeff, where are we right now? Approximately, you have to say where we are. Uh, we're like seven miles uh, 
southeast of Barnegat Inlet. I like Captain Jeff said, we are probably a quarter mile east of the Flemish Cap. What? And we are fishing 300 feet of water with small jigs. What? Here we go, line again. So I'm dropping the jig down, and I hear Maja's ride go off. Here goes Maja. Yeah, Maj. Stay, keep it easy, you got it. Good fish. Oh, nice. Good fish here. Nice fish. Take your time with it. Yeah, take your time. Don't push. Just get, start reeling up. You got it. It's good when you know the rocks. Okay. That's Going up current. I like that. Nice fish, Maja. <laughs> nice fish. Nice fish. Nice fish. Oh, boy. Good job. Oh, that's a fing beast. I love that fing yeah. yeah. <laughs> Don't, don't hit all the crabs out of it. We need to wait. Nice yeah. one. One more. Oh, that's a good oh, cool one, man. $2,000. Coming in, coming in with the camera. <laughs> Are you nervous again? Nervous. I don't think it's that big, man. I think it just f was pissed off. Oh boy. Hey, oh boy. Maj, take over the. Uh... Oh, mine's small. That's a nice one. That's like a ten fish, bro. Good nice. Job. Good job, buddy. Woo! Nice fish. Very nice. Nice fish. 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 Nice that's a nice fish. All right. So, Jeff, this is 76 Bertram? Yep. Oh, girl. How long you had this bad boy? Uh, five years now. And you repowered, right? Yeah, uh, new comments. Uh, 30s. Look at this buffoon distracting the captain when he's trying to double anchor. Double anchor sizzle chest? I'll punch you right in your privates next time we talk like that. Uh, captain Jeff at some point is dropping three anchors on this piece, alright? It's easy to pass a CPA exam then to be able to drop three anchors on a piece and catch fish consistently, alright? Not many people could do that. Maybe Captain Carey on the Lurie Sea. I saw him do quadruple anchors one time, but that was in the 72 Olympics and that has nothing to do with this right now. Captain Carey. Beware, because Captain Jeff may be joining the Hall of Fame with us, all right? That's three people in the Fishing Hall of Fame right now. <laughs> Just kidding! So let's take a peek at this triple anchoring technique here with Scott and Captain Jeff, all right? It's something to behold. So he's got two anchors out already? Yeah. One right now. Oh, one anchor's dropped the second in a minute. <laughs> he's gonna do three. Yep, yeah, and then we'll back up, drop the third, pull tight. Well, if your head's spinning by now, it should be, all right? These uh, ankle lengths have more angles than the impeachment inquiry, for goodness sakes, all right? So basically what's happening now, Scott's dropping the back ankle, which is number three. He's going to pull tight. Everything's going to pull tight. We're going to be on top of the piece, all right? That's how it works. Okay, Sadish, let's get to the next fish. Let me get that. There's one above your head. Oh, I got one. <laughs> there we go. Oh boy. Uh oh. Hold on. He's in my fish. Is he going right? You say the ladies like that. He said these. He's not ever. He's done. He's not ever. He's done. 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 Oh, nice. Sitting pretty now, guys. I think so. Another <laughs> made me top of the Unbelievable, right? What's up? Come here, boy. Jeff, I'm gonna bring my pet home. <laughs> Time to eat it, 
Okay. You need help? Feeling a lot of drag. Okay. All right. Yeah, that's a doubter. Should I get the other net out there? All right. Yep. You need a backup netter? You need a backup netter? That's a valid question, all right? Back in 67, Jeff and uh, Scott would tell me they were in a tournament. When the fish came to the surface, the guy designated netter fainted, all right? He had a psychogenic incident. I think that's what they call it. All right? Not important. He saw the fish come up to the surface. It looked like a world record. Uh, it was probably 40, they estimate 40, 42 pounds. Oh. All right? But what happened was the guy comes up, the guy sees it, and he faints. All right, so what happens? Your net is he's the fat kid in dodgeball. He's out. All right, he's not even in the game anymore. So Scooter comes over with the gaff and uh, does a uh, guilt play gaff on it. All right, 67. They won that tournament. We need backup. We need to knock. We need to get everyone to feel on a first place. Got it, guys. Now we're talking. Oh my god! Nice Bro, now he's got the female in the man. Oh, oh, it blew out his asshole. Oh. There you go, Scotty. That's a nice oh. It blew the shit white leggers oh, out. Shit. shit the white leggers. Alright. Hold that. That's how it got up. Captain, Captain Jeff is no joke right now. Hold that up for the ladies. A little mail coming up this time. Not a little mail, big mail. There we go. Another one. Nice fish. Nicely done, Captain. Nicely done. That thing took off. You can't poop that out, that's weight. Alright, underwater footage. Let's go downstairs, see what's happening down there. But before we do, I gotta plug the con hat, all right? Go to allprotacklebox.com, grab your con hat, it's luck. So get your con hats today, great Christmas presents, Thanksgiving gift, you know, whatever. Get it, go out there, support the channel. Let's go downstairs right now and see what this bite's going on, all right? I'm gonna drop a camera down. I brought a lot of gear out there, I brought cameras, drones. Check out this drone footage real quick. <laughs> Nuts required to repower Cummins 300s work to the nuts. Thing runs like a freaking rape date, and I'm allowed to say that on it because that's a that's a legit saying. But runs like a champ. That thing is fast as beans. I can't believe it. Jeff runs that thing like a champ. All right, let's stay focused here. All right. So that was the boat right there in my little drone footage, which I'm happy I got my drone back. But now let's go downstairs underwater, see what these fish look like. See what see if there's a lot of fish down there. All right. Check it out. There's your underwater footage right now. Con shout outs, not this episode. Why? Because I'm doing a shout out to Accurate Marine in Bohemia. All right? Seriously, Accurate Marine in Bohemia. Guys take good care of the kid and the people that the kid sends there, all right? So, matter of fact, let's go over there right now. Accurate Marine. Let's go. There's my man Alex over there. This is it right here. Oh, there he is. What's going on? A lot of work for these guys right now. Now you go pay the piper right now. Is Kevin in there? Yep. Kevin. All right. Go in there. Well, but he likes being on video. Yeah, he likes being on video. There he is. 
Say hello to the people over in Kid Coach Chase right now. <laughs> We're telling everybody to repower their, uh, right, with Yamaha. Well, you like stickers, man. Yeah, it's a sticker. Hell yeah, that goes on my boat. This is love right now. More for an accurate marine. <laughs> Alex, right there, you repowered me, right? Yep. Alex repowered. He put the SHO on that the lovely uh, incentive out there. Kevin, right there. If you guys ever have to repower, even consider it. He's got a shiitake load of used engines here, too. But if you ever repower, these are my boys right here. Fantastic mechanics. Take care I, of you. Yeah, I wouldn't. I wouldn't mess with anybody else. Seriously, come in here, see Mister Happy right now. He'll talk junk about me. <laughs> Bring your money. Yeah, he'll talk junk about me. But these guys are the best of the business. That's why I always come here. I rest very easily when I come out of here with my bill. All right. See, that's a bill right there. It's really a fake bill because I don't pay for anything. <laughs> Unfortunately, I do. This is going to sting a little bit. So I'm going to pay. But again, I'm going to put the contact information. As a matter of fact, I'm going to throw it right there. Right, Acura Marine. Bohemia, it's the only place to go when you're repowering. Or doing anything, service, everything right there. Again, Alex, you did see him cameo in the last Steigerwald uh, video. <laughs> and there's sunshine right there. Hey, hey. <laughs> all right, I gotta pay my bills. Ooh, I'm back, all right? Love those guys over at Accurate Marine in Bohemia. And if you have the honor, you may even have a setting of Chip the owner right there. That guy is made a mooch. Chip, I All right, so let's go back. Let's do a couple more fish. Check this fish out right here. That's the fish I caught. You know why I'm not on video? Because I'm the only guy filming here, right? It's unbelievable. But I did get a nice fish right there. I counted in our uh, six, that big fish. So I did participate. Uh, I was using, initially I was using snafu rigs when I was doing uh, regular conventional stuff. I did the snafu rig. I pulled the snafu off, went back to a single hook. That's what Maj did. Uh, Maj was doing the same thing. I pulled his off. I gave him a single hook. That's when he hooked into his big fish. So fish were being caught like crazy. Snafu just wasn't working for me. All right, so let's go back to some fish. Hey, Dajin. Maj is on. Maj is on. Oh, all right. All right. I'm just going through this ball. Oh, Jesus. I'm sorry. Did that? Nah. Mm. That's going to make it to the dance now. That's a nice fish. Oh, she's so beautiful. So sexy! <laughs> Where's that de hooker at? Thank you. Are you nervous about this one yet? <laughs> I don't know what to do. It's not that big. Pucker. Cheat it. Pucker. All right, folks, I guess you get the idea there, all right? Captain Jeff put us on the fish. We limited it out. Six guys, five fish each. You guys do the math, all right? It's a lot of blackfish. We appreciate them letting us take some home to have. I already made my blackfish chowder. Just had blackfish again last night. So blackfish is a very good eating fish. We appreciate that, Captain Jeff, for letting me have that stuff. Captain Jeff set the ball way freaking ahead. Job well done, Dick. Big time. It was fun. Very impressed. Very impressed. I, that was like, I haven't had a day that good myself in a long time. I mean, that was real, real impressive to see these two guys work, Scott and Jeff work the boat. I am dying to go back out there again. I'm gonna to try to weasel my way into a December trip with them. See what happens, all right? Could be on the arm. It's not gonna be on the arm. I'll pay my fare, all right? But uh, what a pleasure to fish with those cats right there, all right? Let's go over to the weigh-in right now, see what's happening over there. Uh, the weigh-in is over at Captain Bill's Landing. It's a tackle shop over there. I know nothing about it. But uh, I tried to reach out to the guys that did the uh, one it. Reached out to him on Instagram, the guy who got the biggest fish, which was 16 pounds, man. I reached out to see if he got back to me. If he doesn't get back to me, he's out. No, never got back to me. I'll give you a hint. His first name is Mike, all right? Tried to get him on Instagram, get some permission to use his information to put in this video, but I never heard back from him, so I am not going to use his information without his permission, so. But I want to congratulate the winners of the Captain Bill Landing freaking, those guys had six fish at 61 pounds, man. Gee, that's monstrous. Think about that. The biggest fish was 16 pounds, I believe. The other guys, man, look, see if I can look at it. I'm going to read his post. His post is private. All right, but my recollection is they had 16 pound fish, 13 pound fish, a 12 pound fish, and a six bag limit. 
of 61 plus pounds. I mean, that's ludicrous. So congratulations to that team for winning. Uh, again, I would throw their information up there, but I'm not doing it out with their permission. So sorry to hear that. You guys Google it and see who won that tournament and uh, you'll know. So here we are at the weigh-in. Uh, we weigh in, and I thought that bag limit was bigger than that, but we weigh in 42 and a half pounds of fish for six fish, which is not horrible. It's not horrible, but it's third place, and uh, we don't make third place without Captain Jeff, of course, and Scott. So, awesome day out there, great food, everything was mint. Company was great, and uh, that's that. We got somebody coming in right now. Who's that? Hi, man. What's up? Nah, Luke's here. Luke, come over here, babe. The, well, Kent, the cotton needs to, to see you. Come on down, come down right here. Lock his face and say hello to the ladies. What's going on, ladies? How are you? <laughs> okay. That's my nephew, Luke Bratz. All right, and, uh, he's coming over here. He's got some boat going on in my driveway. But I'm gonna go back onto the boat right now. And we're gonna sign off on this. We're gonna sign off over on the Big Nuts Required too. Ladies and gentlemen, I wanna thank you for watching Kid Cochise Outdoors. Captain Jeff Crilly, Scott Crilly, <laughs> we've, been, have, we've, we've been trying to do this day. for a couple of years now. We've been trying to get this episode for a couple of years now. Watch these guys on social media. Scott was a con kind of shout out back years ago, right? Mm hmm. Uh huh, yeah. that's right. Mm -hmm. So we got this trip together with Maj and uh, we had Steve and Sean. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. What a freaking kick ass captain this guy is. I mean, when it comes down to black fishing, I think what you guys just saw in that video. There are black fishermen and there are guys who can black fish. All right, that's, that's, there's, there's a very fine distinction right there and you'll probably understand when you saw that video. But I wanna thank both these guys for inviting the kid. That's the best part of being kid called Cheese Outdoors. You get to go out and you meet these cats like this, all right? I drove to Jersey, I was up at one o'clock this morning to drive to Jersey to fish with these guys. Zero regrets, what a ridiculous <laughs> amount of fish. Put on a clinic today. A little dirty jigger. Everyone has their day. <laughs> everybody has their day. But I, I want to thank everybody for watching, and I want to thank these two curl, the curly boys. They're my curly boys right now, uh, right? No problem. All yeah. right. I really appreciate them <laughs> having us out here. Man. It was oh, freaking yeah. awesome trip. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Great time. Uh, hope I, I hope I drone. I got my drone back. I got my underwater camera back. I hope that footage worked out. But until next time. Got all the fingers. Everybody's got their fingers. We got a shiitake load of fish, and it was just a sick. We came in third. All right, we're well, not first, Real but uh, sometimes you come in third. <laughs> All right, yeah. thanks again for watching Kid Coaches. We're out of here. Bye, guys. Good night, guys. <laughs> <laughs>Hey guys, congratulations again to the winners of the uh, Captain Bill Landing Fishing Tournament right there. 61 plus pounds. Unbelievable. Uh, consider subscribing below. Like if you like and hit that bell for notifications.